let's make the most amazing air fryer cinnamon swirls or cinnamon rolls whatever you want to call them firstly grab some just roll puff pastry roll it out onto a chopping board take away the little paper that comes in the middle i just want to leave that there now for 10 minutes just to bring it to room temperature once the pastry is warmed up to room temperature, grab two little bowls and preheat the air fryer. Preheat to 200 C. So you're going to want to put in one tablespoon of cinnamon. And then grab two tablespoons of brown sugar. Pop them into the same bowl and then melt a tablespoon of butter i use the microwave to melt mine quickly and then i put the butter into a little bowl grab a pastry brush and then paste the butter all over the ready roll pastry my kids absolutely love helping with baking so i let them do the fun job and told them to completely paint the puff pastry for me Then I grab the little bowl of cinnamon and sugar, give that a mix before sprinkling it all over the puff pastry. This is going to make that lovely tasty filling. These are so good by the way. Try and sprinkle it as evenly as you can. I just went in afterwards and used the back of the spoon to just try and spread the mixture out a little bit more over the pastry. By the time I'd done all this, the air fryer was preheated, so I took the basket out and then roll up the puff pastry. The trick here is not to roll it too tight, but also don't roll it too loose. Just don't really rub it together but just try and leave some little tiny tiny gaps for air make sure to press the edges in just so that the air fryer doesn't fly them open. And then go through and cut it into even slices. I score it first because I find it really hard to visually see this as 12 individual cinnamon rolls. use your pastry brush just to give the top and sides of the cinnamon rolls a little butter just before they go in the air fryer and make sure you don't pack them in too tightly they will expand in there put those in the basket of your air fryer and pop that on for seven minutes you may need a little bit more depending what air fryer you've got drizzle ice in you want half a cup of powdered sugar and two tablespoons of milk we are dairy free well two of us in the house are so i use oat milk so that everyone can have them you can use any milk of your choice give that a little stir and then drizzle them over the buns but make sure the cinnamon rolls have been cooled first otherwise it will just sink into them entirely does take a little while to get the right consistency but just keep stirring and stirring and stirring when the cinnamon rolls are ready take them out of the air fryer and use some tongs to put them on a wooden chopping board or a cooling rack 
and leave them until they're cold before icing.